So in this video, I'm going to share some information about this hair that I am currently rocking and that I absolutely love. Um, I'm still trying to work on perfecting the color and perfecting exactly how I want to wear it. So bear with me, it probably will be changing um, next time you see it. And this is a full lace wig and it's from JennyLaceWigs.com. This is the packaging that it came in. You also have some company information at the top here. You have hair care instructions and you also have special care for curly hair instructions. So yeah. And the hair came in a plastic bag like this with all information on this sheet here. And I will show you guys how the hair came and what it looked like when I first received it. So the wig that I have here is the Brazilian Full Lace Jerry Curl Wig. So I'm going to read the specs of this wig once I first received it before I altered it in any way. So the hair length was 24 inches, the hair color was 1B613, the cap size was small which I really wish I would have got a medium cap size because the small cap does not fit my big old head. Um, uh, the lace color is light brown, the hair density is 110 to 130. When your order is over $119, you get free shipping, so that's pretty cool. So when I ordered my wig, I asked them to customize it for me, which is a great thing. I feel like this company offers um, alteration to your wigs, so you don't have to do all the work yourself. So I asked them to that I wanted a dark root and bleach blonde hair, which is exactly how they sent the wig to me. So now, once I got the wig, it was literally bleach blonde when I tried it on I was like oh my gosh this is not gonna work so all I did was apply a rinse all over the hair left it on for like probably 35 minutes and then rinsed it off and I came out with this color and like I told you guys in the beginning I'm still trying to um, perfect the color because I still want it to be more on the yellow blonde side I feel like it's a little bit grassy to me so I'm still working on the color and I'm still working on exactly how I want to wear it and style it. But I feel like this is pretty cool. So I don't know if you guys follow Beat Face Honey on Instagram, but she was or she still is a Nicki Minaj's makeup artist. And her blonde hair, like every time I look at it, I'm just like, oh, I want that. So that was my inspiration. Um, I don't know how close I got, but I just wanted you guys to know what my inspiration was. So if you think I got pretty close, let me know. Holla at you, girl. A few things that I do want to let you guys know is that if you do plan on having them alter the hair to more of a bleach blonde color, just know that it will be a little bit on the dry side because obviously, even with our natural hair, once you bleach it to a certain level, it starts to get dry and brittle and not as healthy as it once was. So I want you guys to keep that in mind. And with this wig, I feel like um, you guys probably won't be able to tell because of the style that I have it in right now. But I feel like they have, it's more hair at the top in the front area. And it's not as much or it's not as full in the back. Don't get me wrong, it's not thin in the back at all. It's just that I feel like there's more hair at the top than in the back. So I do get some shedding. Like I said, this hair has been through a lot. It's like if you guys look at the texture, you can tell that it's not silky hair. Like you can clearly tell that. Personally, I like that because it feels like how my natural hair would feel. So I feel like the overall texture of the hair looks more natural on me. Like I said, the wig did come in at 24 inches, but while I was styling it today, I did kind of trim some pieces with my razor comb here, and but I feel like the length is still there. So these are not the natural curl pattern in this wig. You guys probably have already noticed that from the clip I showed you guys earlier. All I did was wash the hair, condition it, let it air dry, and once it was dry, I went in with my 1 8 of an inch curling iron by Power IQ, and I got this from Sally's. And I just, you know, like kind of wanded the hair all over, just did this method here. 
and then left it on there for like two seconds because this hair curls so quickly it took me like 30 minutes to curl everything so that was amazing um yeah so i pretty much got this look with this tool here yeah overall i really like this wig highly recommend it like i said it's a full lace wig and on the jenny lace wig website their prices are unbelievable so i highly recommend that you guys check out their website the link to this particular wig will be in the description box below if you guys are interested but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys have any other questions please leave me a comment down below don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thumbs up this video and i will see you guys very soon with a new one